Stevie Pescarino on behalf of Tampa Honda and Wesley Chapel Honda. Today we're going to be reviewing and demonstrating some of the features on the Honda Sensing package. Honda Sensing is available on the 2016 Honda Accord, Civic, CRV, and Pilot. The Honda Sensing package includes lane departure warning system, lane keeping assist system, and road departure mitigation. These features can be used over 45 miles per hour and will alert you if you're departing your lane and if you have Lane Keep Assist active, will help guide you back into your lane. We'll demonstrate this feature later on in the video. Adaptive Cruise Control helps you maintain a set following interval so you don't have to manually change your speed. This feature can be used over 25 miles per hour. Ford Collision Warning works with the Collision Mitigation Braking System to lower your risk of collision. When Ford Collision Warning determines you are at risk for collision with a detected vehicle, it activates audio and visual alerts to warn you if you fail to act, the Collision Mitigation Braking System will automatically apply brake pressure to prevent the collision. Let's hit the road and test out some of the Honda Sensing features. To the left of the steering wheel, you're, first you're going to turn on your road departure mitigation, make sure it's on so that you can use lane keep assist and lane departure warnings. Once that it's on, you'll press the main button underneath the cruise control on the steering wheel. Once that main button's on, your lane departure warnings are on. See how when you start to go out of the lane, it shakes the steering wheel and tells you on the screen that you're departing the lane. Now if you want to keep lane keep assist on, which will help guide you back into the lane, press the button right next to main and you'll see the two lanes pop up on your screen. When the lanes are colored in, that means the lane keep assist is on. Notice how we veer out of the lane and it pushes us right back in. To use adaptive cruise control on your cruise control settings to, on the right side of the steering wheel, you'll press the one on the far right arrow, that's the vehicle with the lanes behind it. On your screen, you'll see three lanes pop up. Once you've pressed that, you'll hit set on the bottom to set your cruise control speed. And then press the adaptive cruise control button again and your adaptive cruise control will be set. There's three different settings for this. You can choose two bars, which is uh, medium length, one bar, which is close, and three bars, which is the furthest away. This is gonna distance you from the vehicle in front of you, and the vehicle's gonna know what speed to go depending on how fast the vehicle in front of you is going. Tampa, Honda.